So let's go right into it. We're going to first talk about the evolution of fashion. You know, different kinds of ways that fashion has evolved, even in Africa and Nigeria. Same thing with you. Yeah. What would some of the trends, if you had to bring some back, what would they be? The bell bottoms are coming back. I think so. The bell bottoms are coming back and I'm pretty much excited about that. And also, I like the fact that fashion is becoming really androgynous mm -hmm. right now. You're not boxing anybody. Yeah, everybody's, everybody's free. bold and yes, fabulous. Everybody's bold, everybody's free to express themselves. I think I like both the idea of both trends coming mm. back. I've always liked the three-piece suits, uh, flared pants, uh, which people used to tell me you can't wear this because it's out of style, but me, I do whatever I want anyway. Um, I'm a really big fan of mom jeans. I feel like it's how you style them. I feel, and I think I can make anything look good. So. Who is mom jeans? Personal opinion. Jeans that are like all the way to the top of your waist. That's what they're called, mom jeans. Yes. Mom jeans, but like straight. I love mom you jeans. think with like I would straight know this? I love Gosh. mom jeans. Mom jeans? Yeah. Well, thank yes, you. Yes, yes. I told you they're teachers' things. And I feel like Umbella wears them really, really well. Really well, yes. Yeah. So they're called mom jeans. Yeah. This is something else. I think I think um, they're called mom jeans in our era. Back in the era, it's very popular for Levi's. So a lot of oh, mothers used to wear it back in the day. So oh, it was just easy it. for it to transcend and being called mom. I told you they knew what they were talking about. <laughs> I told you. Well, speaking of like the changes and evolution of fashion, at some point women wouldn't wear the three-piece suit or the power suits mm -hmm. um, because it was quote unquote for guys. A suit at that time was for guys, but now the power suit is for power. <laughs> it's like woo. it's like everybody is wearing one. Mm -hmm. Everybody and it. It shows class and professionalism and sexiness and True. power again. True. Would you wear a power suit, Idia? I have so many I and bet. I've worn so many. I, I like bet. the fact that now, you know, power can be translated in so many different ways and power is for anybody that's willing to take power. So I would wear, you know, a pink suit and, you know, I would dress it up and make it more feminine or more suited to my style mm -hmm. by wearing like, you know, a bustier or like a lace top on the inside. Mm -hmm. I just really like how you can do whatever you want with the suit. Yeah. You can wear it like, I mean, you can wear the oversized suits if you want to be more tomboyish. You can wear something that's very fitted and feminine. Um, you can do so many things with it. So yeah, I would definitely rock a power suit. What would be a trend or a style that you would bring back? I would say I would bring old Celine back. <laughs> Phoebe Philo, um, she's a very popular designer, which we all loved, but she used to be the creative director for Celine. And during her era, she kind of embodied the whole minimalist, chic thing. So it's very simple, very simple lines, very minimal colors, very classic. And I really liked that because it was also relaxed. Mm -hmm. It wasn't too smart or serious. Now, an example of um, one of our celebrities that styled her power suit with a t-shirt mm -hmm. is Jackie our Ghanaian actress. We see you, boo. I like it. She paired it with sneakers and a t-shirt and the blue. I personally like it. What do you think? Uh, well, I think it's uh, soft. It's very feminine. I mean, it's pastel blue, powder yeah. blue. And yeah. I just love how relaxed it looks yeah. away from the severe, how you normally take your, your suits or your tocks. Mm -hmm. It's very soft. It's less severe. It and it's very down, sporty yeah. at the same time.